Hey guys, today we're back on to another video, and today we're going to be playing Piggy Deceptive Tales, because they released part 2 inside of the game, so let's get started. So the last time we played this game, we were playing the CFC chapter, which was the Red Inn Hotel, but that was a CFC chapter, and it really just provided some character backstory, but in part 1, Robber's Hideout, we escaped a Willow and Rash's Robber Hideout, and now we're going down to Downtown Lucella, part 2. All I know is that this is a pretty small map, I mean the maps are relatively small, but yeah. Part 2 Lucella. Oh, main bot. Hendrix. Oh my gosh, dude, what am I getting myself into? Alright, let's go. Downtown Lucella. I am literally shaking right now because I'm so nervous for this chapter. Oh my gosh, dude. So, the bot is Hendrix, and we're going to Downtown Lucella. Okay, my voice is literally quivering right now. You can't tell, but I'm literally shaking, like, physically shaking. I don't think- I feel like I should be concerned about that. I don't know. Okay. So here's the detective. Faye, right? Yeah, Faye. Finally, downtown. Alright, we're now in downtown Lucella, playing as Faye, just like in chapter one. I'm literally shaking. Where is everyone? Oh my god. You have a Lucella bank? What in the world? Oh, red key. Found red key. Oh, we need blowtorch. Okay. This is a relatively small bank. I'm guessing that's the vault. Okay. Uh, Detective Faye Francis' office. Oh! This is Faye's office. I never knew that. Oh, wow, we have orange key. Wow, Faye has his own office. Dang, he's living life good. Okay. We have crowbar. Alright. We also need some coins here. Dang, I never knew Faye had his own office. Alright. Oh. Oh, uh, what the heck's that? Oh no. Okay, um, what is going on? What is going on? Who's right behind me? Oh, little George. Oh, what the heck? 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 Oh god. Oh god. Oh, okay. Um, I can't go in there. I I need a ditch him. Oh god. Ah, uh, go 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 go. Go, 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 go. Oh god. Oh god. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. Go, go. Close. 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 Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh god. You need to go out. Okay. Uh. Oh god. Okay. It's open. Alright. How am I doing this right now? Okay. Okay. Go, 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 go. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay. What's here? Green key. Okay. Is he outside? Oh, he's outside. Okay, so we have- Oh, so this is the vault. Looks like an elevator. I thought this was an elevator, so this is the vault. We have a coin. Purple key. Okay, what do I do? I have green key. Um, let me see. Alright, I don't know where I have to use green key. I'm just gonna get coin. Oh god. Run. Run! Okay. Oh god. Uh. God. Oh boy. Oh god. Jump! No! No! God. <laughs> yeah, just in a tight situation here. Hehe. <laughs> Oh god. Oh, that's where I use green key. Okay. I see. Alright. Oh god. Go, 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 go. Close. Close. Oh, thank god. Okay, green key. I found green key. There's purple key in there. Oh god. Okay. Three, two, one, go. Go, 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 go. Oh god. Uh, uh. Okay. Okay. Go, 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 go. God. Okay. Oh, God. I'm gonna have to find a way to get in that building. Oh, God. Okay, I got it. Okay. Go, 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 go. Go, go. Oh. Okay, I got scared. Okay. Oh, okay. Blue key. Oh, God. Okay. Go, 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 go. 
Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Uh. Luki. Oh god, there he is. Okay. Is he stuck? Oh my god, he's stuck. Thank god he's stuck. That's all I had to do. Okay. Blue. Alright. Oh, what? Huh? Um. Did he just die? Haha, <laughs> get noob, you died, bro. El Bozo. Imagine dying too to a sign. Oh my god, that's just pathetic. Your life is miserable. El Bozo. Okay, so we have a purple safe here. Where was the per- Oh yeah, the purple key was in the vault. Yeah, rest in peace. Rest in pepper- Wait, who is this guy? Wait, what? What in the world did- Did they just put some animatronic pig chef here? What the heck? Okay. Okay. Purple key, coin! Yay, we got the coin, and- Oh! Crowbar! Um, okay, I'm gonna keep that in mind, so there's a crowbar- Oh my god! They're literally putting an invisible barrier there, oh, okay. The guy literally just teleported there, literally out of nowhere, and just came right behind me, I thought I was dead. Coin. Plank. Where do I use this plank? Can't use it there, that's a ladder. Wait, where do I use this plank? Do, do I give this to this guy? Why is there a pig butcher guy right there? I think that's just the easter egg, I have no idea. Let me get the crowbar. Hold up, so we have to use the crowbar in Faye's office, right? Like, yeah, Faye's office, right over here. So we have to use this crowbar here in Faye's office. Uh, yeah, right here. Alright, uh, let's come here. Use, use, oh wow, the boards came off real nice. Oh! He hello Who are you? Peter? I'm Detective Faye Francis, the owner of this building. Who are you, and what is going on exactly? So is Faye just going to ignore that there's some random person in this building? M m m m my name is Peter. It's a, a, a long story. We should look for, 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 for others out there. Do you have to stutter or something? Why are you stuttering a lot? Are you just really scared? Well, here's Peter. Um, is there anything back here? We have a sleeping bag. I, 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 is, is this guy supposed to be in this building? Oh, there's a ladder here. Okay, uh, oh my god. Move out of the way, my guy. Personal space. Six feet apart. Hey, back off. <laughs> okay. But dang, look at this guy. The model looks really good. So like, here's Peter. Dang, okay. So that's Peter. Alright, so I have a ladder. Oh, we have to use the ladder here. Alright, so ladder. Oh my god, can you move? Personal space, my guy. Six feet apart. Oh my god. Okay, we're just a- Move! Okay, thank you. Uh, ah! Ah! Wait, what? Faye, you, you okay? Wait, what happened? Yeah, I'm fine. Just don't trip on that. Oh dang- Oh my god! The power line literally just fell over. Well, because we placed the ladder down. Huh, how convenient. And I'll never understand pity logic. Okay, let's just climb up here. Peter's literally getting in my personal space, so... Dang. That's honestly really cool. A whole telephone pole just fell down. Dang, they scripted this game well. Oh, now we need the plank. Oh, now I see what's going on. Okay, so now we need the plank. All right, I have the plank. Peter, get out of my personal space. You look a lot like Pony, but like an eBay version of him. Actually, no, you actually look like a better version of Pony, if I'm being honest with you. Okay, so plank here. Uh, move. Okay, so we place the plank. White key! We need this for, like, that diner over there. I remember seeing it, but I never pointed it out. Dang! This is literally our first try, and we're already doing great. You hear that, Peter? We're about to escape. Alright, white key. We're oh, yeah, here. Alright, goodbye, infected. Yeah, get el bozoed by that sign. <laughs> and there's also a phone. Wait, we can use this. Wait, what? Wait, I can click on that. I don't know what's going on. Let's just go ahead and use Waikiki here. Is this it? Oh my gosh, this is the exit. Okay, we did it. Fled Downtown Lucella Award. Okay, hello? Is there anyone here? Bro, are you blind? There's someone right there. <laughs> okay, hello? I'm Tim. Who are you two? Hello, Tim. I'm Peter, and this is Faye. We're not like the others. We're safe. Yeah, be quiet, Peter. You look like Pony anyways. You're not original. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, Peter. I'm sorry. You look like a better version of Pony. Hold on. Like the others? What are you talking about? A few hours ago, everyone started acting hostile. Their eyes would glow, and they'd hunt for anyone. So it's like, a virus? Yay! Great job, Faye! You're finally learning something new about the infection! Yep, before I locked myself in here, I boarded one of the- The thing you put in the crate attacked me out there. Oh, so Tim put some random infected into a crate! It only stopped chasing me because of a sign fell off a building onto it. Yeah, that guy got bozoed by a sign. <laughs> I apologize. I don't. I didn't think anyone else would be near here. Yeah, that infected's kind of stupid if you ask me. <laughs> but now that it's out, we might want to go somewhere else. We can't take any chances. 
Yeah, Tim, why do you look like Tigri? <laughs> I know a place! The old clock tower! It's not too far away. It might be boarded up, but we can try. A boarded up clock tower. Sounds good! Alright, but if anyone gets hurt, it's on you. Dang, okay, Tim, every man for themselves, I see you. <laughs> Is that it? Oh, wait, no! My lord, the butcher has an update on the fox. They're downtown with a horse. You mean by a fox, you mean me, right? Or like Faye. He presumes that- Silence! You need to stop them! Quick! If they grow bigger, who knows what might happen to us? The Dark Lord- Who is this guy? What? I'm sorry, my lord. I'll find them. And stop anyone that might try to help them. Good. Now go. Follow them if they're not gone by tomorrow. Who is this guy? The Dark Lord? And who's this guy? I know. I'll stop them. I promise. What is going on, dude? So, that cheetah guy that we saw from the first chapter, I don't know if it's a cheetah person, but like, they were talking to this person called the Dark Lord. What in the world, dude? Man, this story is getting confusing chapter by chapter. So basically, we beat this thing on the first try. That's surprising. I was really cautious during this one, but like, dang. So we were doing this chapter, some infected got bozoed by a sign, or just like wrecked by a sign, yeah, get noob. <laughs> and then we met Peter, and then we met Tim, we met two new survivors in this, and then now this cheetah person who's like question mark, question mark, question mark, is talking to this person called the Dark Lord. What is going on, dude? I, I think I might need to check out the roleplay, I want to check out the roleplay, can we play as these morphs? Hold on, let me see. Oh my god, okay, bat- oh, Hendrix! Here he is. Okay, so here's Hendrix. Hey, here's Hendrix in all of his glory. I can't really see his face because I have the shift lock glitch, but yeah. So he's holding an axe. His legs are in R15, too, if you can see that. Yeah, that's honestly really cool. What's his jump scare? <laughs> oh. Okay, so basically he just comes up to you and he just swings with the axe. That's pretty violent. Okay. But, uh, yeah, guys, I think I'm just gonna end off the video here. This was me playing Piggy Deceptive Tales Chapter 2, or Part 2. Did this man just ragdoll onto the floor? <laughs> but, yeah, this was me playing Piggy Deceptive Tales Chapter 2, and, uh, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This was a really cool chapter, to be honest, honestly. The story's just getting crazier and crazier. Like, first of all, who is the question mark, question mark, question mark guy? Like, that cheetah guy. And who's the Dark Lord? Is that, like, the T.O. of this story? I have no idea, but this story is getting interesting, let me tell you that. I wonder where we're going to be going in Chapter 3. I mean, all we know is that we're going to a clock tower, but what's going to happen? What's what's the Dark Lord going to do? I have no idea, but yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. The story's just getting crazy, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.